How you doing today? Oh, that's what I'm trying to see. <laughs> hey, well, you got a great laugh. You sound blessed. Well, hey, I feel good. Heck yeah, man. Yeah, I uh, I tour around town and uh, take pictures of uh, public accessible areas, public workers. Um, try to make sure everybody's doing good, that the city's doing good. Right. Yeah. So you, you can film us. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can film anything. As long as you're in public, if you're in a public accessible area, you can take pictures of everything. And, and it, it's, uh, it's really good because that's how we keep people um, transparent without breaking laws. And... Okay, well, um, technically there's no penal code te either. There's no law that an officer could enforce. Like, I just got done speaking with the sheriff. I, left, I just left downtown. I'm not, I'm not worried about, I'm not, I'm not worried about that. You don't have to, just save it for someone that needs it. Because I am very healthy and uh, I'm not afraid of something that I've never met anybody that's had it. What's going on over here? What's going on over here? Don't shine your light at me. Don't shine your light at me. Uh oh guys, we got a clown. out of my face turn your light off sir turn it off now right to video in public accessible areas you're not coming in here yeah I'm in here you need to leave no HPD will be here in a minute okay this is publicly accessible buddy okay, you gonna find out find out what okay you can't come in here. well if the cops get here and give me a trespass okay. warning yeah, for being in public if the cops come here and give me a trespass warning for being in public, understand that they're going to be putting themselves at risk for a lawsuit. Okay. So they're not going to want to do that. I just talked to the sergeant this morning, buddy. Okay. You're talking to the wrong clown. Our problem is we're under COVID conditions. We and so you're still open. The door's open. Try not to get sick. Door's open. What are you talking about? The door's open. Because we have visitation. And I am visitation to get a roster. You're not visiting anything. I have official business to get a roster. Not even that. This guy wants to lay his hands on me. We're not always this nice. I'm being really nice. Sir, can I speak to your supervisor now? Sir, you are not debating. You're right there in our property. I'm not trying to debate anything. You're not cooperating, sir. Cooperate. Quit resisting. Give me your name. Failure to identify is against your policy, sir. Was he going in the, go hide in the closet? <laughs> what the hell was that? Even the other security officers are laughing at this dude. He literally just went and hid in a closet. That was a closet, guys. That's not a room. That's a closet. Ma'am, are you pretending to be on the phone? Because you already told him everything and you're not talking anymore. You're not talking anymore. You're just holding the phone now. It's okay, I'm just here for the city of Houston to get a little public information for the people. There's so much, you know, these interactions with police and stuff, uh, the paperwork and everything that goes into it, the time you have to wait, it's a long process. And so um, the parking lot's legal, we went over that, BJ Simmons, I mean, he was saying, I think he's mentally unfit, honestly. Um, he, he said, could you step out of the vehicle? And I'm standing up on a sidewalk outside. Mm -hmm. If you're worried about your mask thing, you should wear it properly. You should wear it properly. Do favor, step out of the vehicle. Step out of the vehicle? That is, that's, I'm not even in a vehicle, sir. You're not making sense. Do you need to retire? And he said, step out of the vehicle. It's not good. And the last time I spoke with him, he wasn't really making sense either. And uh, he was actually telling me that I should not film police officers. And it was my fault that his officers screamed in my face because I shouldn't video them. Oh.
Hey, I'll be around for a little bit, man. You have a blessed night tonight, and uh, if you see me later, you get a call on me. Don't come beat me up, okay? I'm just taking pictures. Cool? You have a good day, Maldonado, if that's what it was. Mal Maldonado, is that right? Sir? Is it Maldonado? Sir, I'm trying to be polite here. If you're cordial, then it's easy, man. Like, Wow. Okay, guys. Well, this is how HPD likes to act to people that are even being nice. Here's the officer that was parked earlier. I told you not to beat me up when you show up, remember? Remember? Nothing. Filming a traffic stop, filming an arrest is nothing illegal. I'm on the sidewalk, there is no caution tape. Okay? okay? That officer just laid his hands on me. Okay. I'd like to file a report. Okay. So get out your notebook. Okay. You're not gonna do your job? Okay. Failure to duty. Sir, I'm on the sidewalk here. If there's a, a, a crime scene, you can put up caution tape. Yeah, but there's a... Go Sir, ahead. don't touch me. I'm not gonna touch, but I'm gonna... Don't, you're you right up against back. me. Look, 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 he's pushing Step me. Back. Get your hand off of me now! Step back. Get your hand off of me now! Step back. Get your f***ing hands Step off back. of me now! Step back, and you're fine, all right? I'm fine without you touch me. I'm not gonna touch you, but okay. remove your hand from me now. Remove your back. hand from me now, sir. Remove Stand your hand right from me there. now! Stand right there, don't lean into me. Get off of me! Very good, thanks, sir. Little education here for the deputy. Hey! Get away from me right now! Get away from me right now! Sir, this street is blocked. Are you trying to assault me? Don't me. touch me, sir. You want me? Get away don't from touch me, sir. Get away from my Don't officers. you dare touch me. Get away from me. my officers. Don't touch me. Get away from my officers. You don't touch me. You don't go behind you don't officer touch like me. that again. Hey, I'm walking up next to him just to Let's listen. Go. Uh, you see, I'm a cameraman. A I'm a cameraman. A huh? You want to touch me, sir? You're on the paperwork tomorrow, coward. Please like, share, and subscribe. Hey, how you doing, man? How are you doing today, brother? What's that? Come right here for a quick I'll talk to you right here. Nah, I can't talk to you in here, man. Why not? This is publicly funded, so I would like to stay in the public office. Yeah, that's cool, but I can't have you up here, bro. Well, you're confronting me in a public office. Okay, I, I, I hear you, but I can't This is you. publicly funded, you understand? I, I so any you. any place that's publicly funded... I hear you, man. And, and so the fact of the matter is that I've asked questions and they're refusing to answer my questions. Okay. If, if you refuse to help me in this moment, know that you're live on the internet that's and there's right. a whole bunch of people watching you. So that's if right. you act a fool, Come on. it's going to really be bad. I can't because you. I can't have you Look, these people are laughing. They think it's a joke. Come on, man. They think it's a joke. Don't touch me, sir. Don't touch me, sir. Sorry. This officer is making contact with me, folks. Look. How you doing? Yeah. Come, let's Don't touch me, sir. No, I'm here standing in a public lobby. Let's leave, please. I'm in a public lobby. Okay. We're going to get the police here for you. Won't you can call the police, and they can explain that this is a public lobby. That's cool. I'm not creating a disturbance. I'm asking questions, and it's all been on video the whole time. Yeah. yeah. We stand up for the Constitution. Guys, yeah, we're, not saying that you guys are bad people. we're just trying to do good stuff, and, uh, you know, we're trying to stand up for... Like, and then see, like, every time I talk, you talk over me. You know? Every time I talk, you talk over me. No, I haven't got many sentences in, because every time I talk, you talk over me, just like I just did to you. And it's not right, it's not nice, man. Where I'm from, people have conversation. That's one person talks, and another person talks. We didn't have a conversation out there. I was explaining something, you guys were talking over me. I know, but I came in here peacefully, and you're still talking over me, and just carrying on a grudge. And I don't want you to do that. I'm just telling you I'm a peaceful person. I'm trying to be peaceful. Change, man. I'm trying to be peaceful and loving. I'm, that's what we're doing is right. making change. The way to make change is through the legislature. Mm -hmm. And so, but first you have to expose the tyranny and then expose it to the legislature so it can be fixed, correct? Because if I have no evidence, evidence is nine tenths of the law. Evidence nine tenths of the law. I have all the evidence I need now. No, 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 no. I study too much law. I might look stupid, but I, trust me, I'm not. That, that officer, uh, I'm not no, going to no, do no, a bunch Ferguson, of... Ferguson, Ferguson. all right. So Ferguson, uh, I ain't doing a bunch of paperwork and junk, but maybe y'all can go speak to him about reaching for his weapon on photographers because uh, I had already had a 20-minute conversation with him. He knew what I was there to do. We were on the scene the entire time. Once it was all over and he went to his vehicle, 
I went to approach his vehicle to ask him for some complaint forms or where I could get them. And, and he drew his that. weapon. When he had just got done having a conversation with me for over 20 minutes, he knew damn well I didn't have no weapons and what my intent was to do. So the reason why this place has the highest police justified killings is because of officers like that. And okay. Okay. No, that's this is different. I don't have to read anything, I don't think. He told us to come outside and record. Why are you saying we can't record here now? Because you're on the curtilage of the property, which is in the order that you're still in violation. Well, he didn't delineate that. Okay, just I, I, just, I just handed you the order. So we Please have to go to the sidewalk and film the door. That is correct. Okay. okay. And so, From the sidewalk, you guys can I, may I ask you a question before I retreat to the sidewalk? Because I am going. I'm not refusing. I'm just going to ask if I can. May I ask you a question you before I go out the way? Because I know once I go out there, you're not going to come and answer my question. Would you come out to the sidewalk and talk to me? I'm not going to do that. Okay. So I'm if just I asking you. Could, you could I speak? You ask you one question while I retreat to the sidewalk? May I? Sir, I need you to stop filming. If you're up here, you're in violation of the law. No, no, no. They don't have a cell phone or a computer at home. They come in to set an appointment. That's why all those lobbies have chairs for the public to come in and set an appointment. So who's to say that I'm not here to set an appointment? Actually, the truth of the matter is, is that when we first walked into this building, he stated that he would like to bring us into the building to show us how he got his business license and became successful. We have yet to go and be able to do that, and our freedom of movement was violated. Y'all's oath was to uphold the Constitution and our rights, the freedom of press, the freedom of movement and at this point we are being infringed on and y'all are following suit and if you just follow orders like Nazis then you'll become Nazis just like they did we need to wake up America what are y'all doing who are you fighting for I'm doing this for my children and their children I already got two kids man and I'm fighting for those kids because what's gonna be what's gonna be like in 20 years you know it's just getting worse you remember when you were a little kid it wasn't like this and you know when y'all were little kids it wasn't like this and look how bad it is now Look how bad it is now. Where's it going to be in 20 years, man? Y'all are following the wave into destruction. Look, we, we need y'all to stand up for us. And and the, and the cameraman is is not your enemy. I'm not saying you are. I just think there, there's times there's times where officers are getting overthrown during their scene that the cameraman saves their life. You understand? I'm not your enemy. To push me back into treatment is that how you would treat your family member? Yeah, I would. No, you wouldn't. Yes, and if that's how you treat your family member, that's sad. That's why. I need the name of the officer that activated his lights while he pulled into this place. I don't know who that was, but... Well, he's back here. He just pulled in, and he's misusing, he, he's misusing our equipment. So I'm just saying he's misusing our equipment. He's misusing our equipment. Right. Can I talk? And you know who he is. Can I talk? You're lying. You gonna let me talk? Or you what do you have to tell me? Are you gonna keep the keys? I want to hear his name. I don't know who he is because... I didn't see anybody activating the lights. Can you go and investigate, please? Okay, well, I have it on video. Stop, Would you stop, like me to stop, pull it up on stop, video for stop, you? Stop, stop, stop. Let me talk. You okay, well, what do you have to tell me? Do you want me to talk or are you going to... I'm wondering what you're trying to tell me. I'm not sure. Are you going to ask me or no? What's your question? Are you want me to give you the information or are you just going to cut me off? I mean, what's the information you have to offer? Okay, so what I'm telling you right now is... You can't go in a security. Uh, I didn't. You don't tell us. Don't, don't tell You're giving me a directive, bro. I never went into a secured area. We're already not doing, and that we're not going to do. I know where I can and can't go. Trust me. Cops all over do. That's why we do what we do. Be giving us. How about this? Don't beat your wife and don't fornicate with your partner's wife. And you'll give me a. Directive. That sounds about as smart as you giving us directives right now. You're not doing something. You're not doing. You're not going to do. You're not going to do those two things, are you? So are you going to okay. let me finish so talking? You're, not going to let me, you're, you're not trying to tell me what to do. So you're going to let me finish talking? You're trying to, you're trying to tell me what to do, and we already know the rules. No. Making a fool of so, yourself, telling me things that's so not to do. Can I finish talking, or are you going to keep? What do you have to tell us? Let's hear what you have to say. Oh, you're going to let me talk? What do you have to say? Yes or no? Are you going to let me talk? Yes or no? Hello, I'm waiting for you to tell me something. I'm answering a question. I can't. What's your question? Are you going to let me finish talking? Are you going to ask a question or are you yes, going to go in loops, man? I'm trying to get a question. I answer this is this hilarious. Way. Answer my Let's do it this way. You're going to start about Let's go.